Oh. He knows where we are. Oh, he got us in the butt. Oh, you got in here. Look at you. No way. You got to be kidding me. <laughs> oh, no. Right before we were level 15. Oh, that's terrible. Now we have the death penalty. And we're going to respawn in here with the Jaguar sitting in the cave. No way. What do we do about that? Welcome back, everybody, to Icarus. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we are going to go out and about and uh, see if we can hit level 15. We are almost there. I got two or three more levels overnight from mining. We have a lot of ore in here. The copper and iron are being smelted. I also have some gold in here, but this furnace, although it can hold the gold, it can't smelt the gold. Uh, but I mine the gold now just because uh, I wanted to get the XP from doing so. There is nothing left in this cave that I can mine because it's either too high level of an ore for my iron pick or I can't reach it. Um, and I don't have, currently don't have ramps yet. We'll get some ramps, but I don't have those. Uh, so we have, oh, stupid pneumonia. Uh, we have, you know, mined everything we can. This is aluminum, so I can't mine it with an iron pick. And uh, we have some plutonium, uh, plutonium, <laughs> platinum. Uh, platinum and titanium nodes in here as well uh, a decent amount of them actually but we just can't uh, we can't get those with an iron pick so we're gonna have to come back after we get a steel pick made to get uh, to get that stuff but otherwise we've pretty much cleared um, everything else out of here that we can can clear out of here so this is a platinum this is a titanium and uh, yeah, we can't we can't hit those. There's another platinum up there with the pick here. There's a platinum up there as well. So we will come back and get those once we have uh, uh, once we can make ourselves a steel pick. Okay, so um, I want to hit 15 because once we hit 15, uh, we can get some more uh, advanced upgrade kind of things from what we're currently using. And so let's just go out and do a couple things outside to do that. Now we do have a rainstorm that started up right before I started the recording. Um, so we might wait that out, or at least wait until the worst of it, the little red part in the upper right-hand corner is finished. Uh, I also want to get some wheat today so that we can make flour, so that we can make flatbread, and keep our eyes peeled for corn and watermelon as well uh, to, to make some of those foods. So this is currently just making charcoal, and uh, I made, uh, we got some coal in here and some extra iron ore. I have one stack of iron ore in there. And I have a stack of iron ore in here, which we're going to use to make our next level of arrow, which we'll be able to do once we hit level 15. Okay, so I think what we should probably do, though, is make some more. We only have 19 bone arrows. Eh, should we make a few more of those? Yeah, we probably should. So we're, we're going to need some leather, some of that, and some sticks. Let's just make a few more of those, because we're not quite there yet. Uh, yet to 15. Uh, as far as talents go, we have two talents and one solo talent. Let's go ahead and do the solo talent first. This is going to give us faster stamina regeneration. Uh, this gives us faster movement speed. I want both of those. Uh, but I, I think we'll go with the stamina generation for now. And then for the rest of the talents, uh, we got our arrow velocity up. What's that? That's reload speed. Not so worried about that. Uh, that's the chance to slow, fire an additional bolt, soft spot. I want to get to the soft spot so we can increase our critical damage even more. The slow is pretty good, though, too. It really is. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and actually take slow but we'll get all of those eventually okay so yeah we're just gonna let this continue uh, smelting the rest of the iron and copper that's in here and um, everything is in good repair so yeah it uh, looks like the worst of the storm just passed so let's head on out here and we kill a couple of decently high level critters we should 
uh, be able to get to level 15. And there is our usual Jaguar that gets stuck out there. We'll shoot him in the butt. Oh, he doesn't even know where we are. Oh, he knows where we are. Oh, he got us in the butt. Oh, you got in here. Look at you. No way, you gotta be kidding me. Oh no, right before we were level 15. Oh, that's terrible. Now we have the death penalty. And we're going to respawn in here with the Jaguar sitting in the cave. No way. What do we do about that? Let's just wait a second and see if he disappears. Oh my goodness. That was some bad luck, you guys. That was some really bad luck. Um, He is damaged, but he's probably healing back up. This is not good. We're going to respawn right where the Jaguar is. Dude, get up and get out of here. You already completely ruined my day. Okay, there he goes. He's getting up. Turn around go outside. No, 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 go outside. Come on, dummy. <laughs> He's over, over by the bedroll. I can't believe that happened. That's like, is that like our first death? I think that's our first death. I was expecting a lot more. I don't know what to do. I really honestly don't know what to do. Um, I guess we could respawn, grab our stuff as quickly as possible, and turn around and try and knife him. Um, if he kills us again, we're going to have an even bigger death penalty, though. The other option is to try and run out of the cave and have him chase us out and then run back in. We got to do something. We can't sit here forever. Come on, take it all. Oh man, not good. Okay. Let's take a suture kit. Or no, we didn't need a suture kit. We need a bandage to stop the bleeding. Come on. We have another one behind us. Trying to get in too. Oh, wow. That was some bad, bad luck. Okay, let's take this and this and this. Hopefully this guy can't sneak in here. Cannot believe that happened. Oh, all right, so uh, where is my torch? Right here. Uh, here, let's use this one. Yeah, if you look in the upper left-hand corner, we have to pretty much do all of almost all of level 14 again now. We've got to get rid of the red before we can do anything more. Oh, that is terrible. Such bad luck. Okay, well, it is what it is. Can't do anything about it. No point in complaining. Um, it's too bad that Jaguar got in here, but he did, so. There, take that, you doity rat. Okay, well, we'll just, we'll just grind it out. That's all we can do. We've got to really be careful of our health, though. We don't want to die another, another time. We absolutely don't want to. Okay, let's, um, how many, we got 32 bone arrows. Yeah, we're pretty good on bone arrows. Uh, get that back in there. Okay, we're going to go up the hill. Up this way. Because we had some, uh, there was some wheat up there. And I want to go grab that wheat. And we'll use this bone sickle. Man, what rotten luck. Total rotten luck. That buffalo fighting something? I hear something off that way. A 
There's a Komodo there. Okay, let's go get this wheat. I think it's just over here. We should grab some more berries whilst we're at it too. Where did I see that wheat at? Yeah, right here. Yeah, let's just stay hunkered down here while we harvest all this. That's it. Inventory's full. Um, yeah, that's good enough. Okay, let's go. That should make us, I'm guessing, probably around 20 flatbread, which will last us for a little while. Jeez, I still can't believe that happened, man. We were right on the cusp of level 15, where, so we can get better arrows, and <laughs> we got our butt handed to us by that jaguar. He came into our own home and violated us. Can you believe that? Can you believe that? Okay. Never mind that I've been violating the Jaguars all along. So, it was their turn to get revenge. Okay, we're going to throw all of this in here. And we're going to turn it into flour. Oh, stupid storm. Really? Oh, that's a minor storm. Okay, I'm not too worried about the minor storm. And then, uh, then this we can turn into dough in this station, and then we can cook it up and make flatbread. Okay, let's repair this. Pop off our berries, our meat, and our bacon, and head on back out. This is just a minor storm, so I'm not too worried about it. It will slow us down a little bit, but let's just keep keep on keeping on. I don't want to sit in the cave all day. We've got too much stuff to do. Okay, we really need to find some corn and some watermelon. And also, if we could find some soybeans, we could go fishing and make... Well, we're not quite ready for that yet. We can make fish curry in the potbelly stove. Yeah, actually, you know what? We can make the potbelly stove. We have enough resources for that now. And uh, fish curry is really good food. It gives us like a whole mess of health. Oh, crap. Jaguar. Oh, I hit the wrong button. No, wrong button. I'm dead. I... T I, I tapped out of the window. <laughs> oh, no! Oh! This is, gonna, this is the bad luck episode, guys. That's all there is to it. It's the bad luck episode. What more can it possibly be? Oh, all right. Let's wait for that Jaguar to get out of here. Cannot believe it. Let's respawn. All right. Now we have to get the entire level 14 back. Here's our stuff. Let's just stay stealth and hopefully that Jaguar is far enough away for us to grab our, our stuff. Yeah, I know. I should have waited for the storm to be over, but we got to do things, man. We can't sit in the cave all day. That's my excuse. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. Whether you agree with it or not. I'm not even so sure I agree with it. Okay, let's just go nice and quiet here. Hopefully that jag kept moving to the west. All right, we're back in business. Okay, 
Let's go this way. We cannot forget how dangerous it is out here. We've been, not, you know, relatively safe tucked inside of our cave, but man, come out here and it is no joke. I really do need to wait for this storm to finish because it's slowing us down by 30%. So, you know, add that to accidentally tabbing out of the game when you're being attacked by a Jaguar and that's a recipe for disaster. For sure. Okay, the storm is now abating. We no longer have the debuff. What I think I want to do is let's move more towards the water. Turn that off for now. In fact, let's make another one. I always, always want to have a spare torch in my inventory. And we are looking for watermelons, and we are looking for soybeans, and we're looking for corn. Not sure I've seen any of those yet. What is this? That's coal. Okay. We might make use of that later on. We'll see. Let's look at the map here. Okay, yeah. Let's move over towards the water. We can lure a couple of bears and some wolves and jaguars into the water and kill them. That'll get us probably level 15. But we want to make sure there's no crocs around, of course. There's a jaguar on the shore and two crocodiles over that way. Some emu. Okay, this was the spot. Look at there's three crocs over there. That's brutal. This is the spot where we were before, and there weren't didn't seem to be any crocodiles around here. Okay, let's see if we can bait that jaguar to, into coming over here. He's kind of far away. down. There's our pod right there. Let's go look on this island over here. Let's see if there's any of this stuff we're looking for. Here, we'll grab a fish while we're at it. Sure, why not? Watermelon, there's some more wheat there. 
What's this? That looks like gold. That is gold. All right. Very good to know that that's there. When the time comes. Oh, there's corn. Nice. Okay. That means we can make creamed corn. Just be careful. Okay, let's grab a bunch of this. I believe this stacks in a hundred. I don't know if I want to take all of it right now, because if this is the only corn around, we might want to come back and get some later for a garden. Let's just take one more plant. Okay, how much did that give us? 62. Okay, that's good enough. We'll leave the rest of that there, and now that we know that it's there. Okay, good. Very good, very good, very good. Now, if we can find some watermelons, we can make fruit salad with the watermelons and the berries uh, in our new cooking station that we made. I'm not really seeing... I don't remember seeing watermelons or pumpkins or carrots or anything like that around here. But now we have wheat and corn. All right, why don't we move towards the west end of the valley here. There's another jag over there we could probably snipe and take out. There must be a spawn point for him. So let's just move directly across the lake here. Make sure there's no crocodiles hunting us. him. Man, that sucks so much. It's already 3.30 in the afternoon. We got a big setback. Big setback. Okay, is that a Jaguar there? I don't know what that is, but we're going to shoot it. Yeah, it's a Jaguar. Ooh, look at that. Stealth kill. That's kind of close to that crocodile, though. All right, let's be careful. Oh, another Jaguar. Okay, run. This is definitely a spawn area for those guys. Decent XP though. try and go after that other one or not. Let's just move this way. We're at full health, so... As long as we don't get crit, we could probably take on a Jag on foot if we had to. Do we need to also keep an eye on the durability of my knife? Much dur more durable than the other knives, but it still wears out fairly quickly. Oh, there's more corn over there. Okay, good. Very good to know. Okay, so we have corn in the area. Let's stay stealthed. 
further away we get from the lake, the more dangerous it's going to be. Problem though is it's going to get dark. I hear something growling. Ravenous. Consume 100 food items. Okay, there's something off over that way. I can hear him, but I can't see him. Oh, there he is. It's a jag. something over that way too. Alright, I can't see him from here. I want to see if I can get a sneak shot off on him. Something's walking over there. I think it's an emu. Okay, let's go this way. Quietly? I saw him right up here somewhere. Are just ferns. Yeah, I don't think we have any like pumpkins and watermelons and carrots and that sort of thing in this vicinity. Where am I at? Oh, we're not too far away from our cave, which is a good thing. Except for that we know it's not a guarantee that the jags can't get inside. All right, <coughs> excuse me. I don't know where that cat went to. He was right up in this area, but I can't see him now. Sounds like he might be over this way. Start moving back towards the cave because it's getting dark. There's a deer. Okay, that's probably going to attract some predators. Uh, I hear a pig. I wouldn't mind getting some more bacon. Oh, there's the jaguar right there. Got him. And there's a boar. Okay. Let's get the boar first, because he's more important than the jag as far as resources go. Oh, we got some white meat. Nice. That's um that's actually really good meat too. Okay, let's get this jag real quick before any more predators can show up. And then we got we gotta get ourselves back to the cave. It's getting dark. Okay, let's go. Oh no, lightning storm, seriously? 
This game does not give me a break, man. It does not give me a break. Alright, we might need to just run for it. Except for I think there's a jaguar right in front of us. No, that's just a bird, okay. Alright. We gotta run for it. We do not want to get hit by lightning. It is not fun. In case you guys didn't know that. Woo! Okay. Reasonably safe and sound. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna throw this corn in here. Oh, yeah, reasonably safe and sound. I'm stuck. All right, well, here, let's shoot him. Okay. Uh, put the corn in here, and let's make creamed corn. Oh, we gotta put water in there too. Um, so let's go. Well, we're gonna have to fill up our bladder. So let's go down here. We'll fight a few worms, get a little more XP in the process. Wrong button. worms. under. Yeah, he did. Didn't get a good solid hit off on that one. We got him, though. Okay. Let's grab all this stuff. I'm putting their giblets in the chemistry herbalism bench, because I think we can do something with it, make like a medicine, but or a poison or something like that. Not a hundred percent sure about that though. Alright. Takes care of them. Now, let's fill up our bladder. And take it back up here. Now we can make tin creamed corn. Craft. Why aren't you crafting? I don't understand. It should be crafting. Oh, I guess I, uh, I'm sorry. I forgot. I got to put the water in the thing. I thought it would pull it out of my inventory, but it doesn't. There we go. Okay. This is good because it gives us uh, 75 maximum stamina, 150 maximum health, and 10% less stamina consumed by our actions. So that is pretty good stuff. Let's get this white meat hooking up over here. Uh, let's see. We're going to need some more wood, actually. Is there wood in there? No. You're done smelting, so I'm going to just steal all of your wood. And the bacon... Yeah, we'll cook the bacon, too, and the fish. Good. This we will turn into... 
Uh, this meat here will turn into more animal fat. And I guess we can throw the stringy meat in here for now. Okay, now this should be done making all the flour from earlier. So now we put it in here to make dough, but we're going to need uh, more water for that. So let's just put all that stuff in there for the moment. Okay. Um... 100 maximum stamina, 150 maximum health, 20%, uh, no, plus 20 health regeneration per minute, and 5 experience gain. Yeah, that's that's actually really good stuff. Uh, so the creamed corn, that, the flatbread, we're, we're definitely moving up in the world when it comes to our diet, which is a good thing. All right, guys, well, I think I'm going to let you go here. This was kind of a sucky episode in some ways, anyways. It wasn't all bad, though. I mean, you know, we got... We, we made some progress on our food. So there's that. <laughs> we got some decent kills in later on, even though we ourselves got our butts handed to us early on in the episode. But that's the way it goes sometimes when you play on these settings, I guess. Let's get everything repaired here. Uh, so I'm going to just wait out the night here in the cave. And then tomorrow, we will... Um, set out and hopefully accomplish what I was wanting to accomplish today. Uh, and that is getting to level 15. We should. I mean, we're all, we almost paid off our deficit. Uh, but we should, you know, we could have been like to level 16 or 17 <laughs> uh, today if things would have gone better. But it is what it is, right? It is what it is. Okay. So I'm going to let you guys go here. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share out the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.